All right, here with head coach Mark Duffner after the spring game. And coach, I saw some good things today, and uh, I'm, I'm sure you did as well. Yeah, uh, I thought we did some good things in all three phases of the game. Uh, offense came out uh, first series there, able to move the ball, uh, get that in the end zone. Uh, did a nice job there. Uh, defense really responded well. The next series they came out, uh, got a stop. So it was kind of a little bit of a back and forth here today, and it was uh, really nice to see both sides of the ball. Um, you know, offense getting in the end zone, uh, moving the ball, defense being able to get some stops. Uh, got a little bit of special teams work in there as well, so nice to see uh, those guys that were able to execute as well today. Coach, it kind of looked like the offense a little bit ahead of the defense at this point. Is that kind of what you expected, or did you expect maybe the opposite? Uh, you never know, <laughs> truthfully. Yeah, you just never know. You know, this spring's been a little bit different for us. We didn't do a lot of crossover work this year. We only had four days where we actually did crossover. So really uh, was was uh, pretty unsure here coming in today how things would end up. Coach, you talked about in the post game after the game, the adversity. We won't get into the adversity side of things, but uh, what do you expect? What did you expect after the uh, injury happened? And just uh, just touch on how you felt the guys responded after the after the gruesome injury there. Yeah, I talked about you know about that being a adversity. Obviously, kind of the worst uh, worst case of uh, adversity that you can really encounter. But you know those type of things happen in game. Injuries happen in games, and things don't always go the way that you want in the game. So you know we've talked a fair amount here this spring and, and through spring ball about uh, staying composed. And if you know guys start to lose their composure just making sure that we're able to uh, get back on the sideline and regain that uh, that composure so that was really one of the points of emphasis for us here today as well is just uh, having that time mm -hmm. on the sideline be able to get some water get some air yeah. and just uh, get refocused and, and being able to go back out and play one play at a time coach you also touched on the competitiveness level of the group today I thought the competitive uh, nature was great today and just touch on that a little bit as well Again, you know, one thing we want to see is, uh, you know, competing. You know, we talked about, you know, um, playing playing for 60 minutes. You know, we want to start from the first half of the game, and uh, we want to play a full 60-minute game. And I thought our guys did that here today. Um, you know, certainly some uh, pride on the line. You know, the offense wants to get after the defense. The defense wants to get off after the offense. So it's nice uh, for those guys to have an opportunity to, to compete here. And then, you know, obviously this will happen here again in fall, and then. Uh, eventually, once we get to Morehead State, we'll become, uh, we'll be, all be on the same page here and uh, getting after the Dragons. So, Coach, uh, wrap up a long spring practice for the guys. They're glad to be done, but uh, the summer awaits. So, what do you expect from the guys in the summer going into the fall camp to get ready for the Dragons on September 5th? Yeah, you know, this summer we, we've made a strong push to get guys here for the mm -hmm. summer. Uh, you know, getting them on campus, getting summer jobs. Um, working out here uh, morning and uh, afternoon. We'll, we'll have two groups here, so the guys have an opportunity to uh, work out based on their schedule. Um, we'll give the guys opportunities in the evenings if they want to do some one-on-ones or if they want to do some pass Kelly on their own. Uh, it'll be good, uh, good opportunity again to do some, do some competition there. All right, thanks, Coach. Great spring, and can't wait for the fall. Okay, you bet.